Welcome to this Windows and computer channel and as we are talking about security updates and what the different terms used by Microsoft and used in security updates mean. So in the first video we talked about zero day. In this video we're going to talk about what is a critical security flaw as Microsoft describes it when we are doing Windows updates. So again, we have critical and we have important. Critical is a security flaw that in general will mean that it's probably not exploited. There's a good chance that nobody knew about it, but it is so bad that you need to fix it. And for example, this month of August 2020, there are 17 critical security vulnerabilities within the Microsoft ecosystem. Remember that when we talk about um, a certain number of updates and security updates like this month is 120, it doesn't touch just Windows. It's 120 for the Microsoft ecosystem. So that means Windows, that means Microsoft Edge, Internet Explorer, these are all dealt with separately. So a security flaw in Microsoft Edge is not a Windows security flaw. It's a Microsoft Edge security flaw. It is in a different category. Uh, some of them are Microsoft Office. Some of them are .NET, for example, and so on. Windows itself has a certain number of that 120 security flaws, but different products around it have the rest and that makes a total of 120. Same thing for the 17 critical flaws. They're not all within Windows. There are some in Windows, some in Office, some in um, Microsoft Edge, Internet Explorer and so on. So critical means they need to be fixed but often what happens with the critical ones is that Microsoft knows about it they will know about it for a certain number of weeks. They work on a fix and they will disclose that there was some critical flaws when they do the patch Tuesday update. They don't tell you exactly what because you know you don't want to tell the hackers out there, oh, well, you got to do this and you got to use this tool to actually exploit these critical flaws because that would be bad. But the fact that they are disclosed and that they tell you, well, there's 17 security flaws, uh, one is in there, one is that, one is that, one is that, will of course help hackers search for what exactly is the security flaw and how can we exploit it. That's why we need to keep our systems updated because as soon as a patch Tuesday is released, Hackers are looking at what are the flaws they can exploit easily to actually get and exploit and, you know, maybe um, take over your computer or, you know, spy on you by um, or send ransomware and so on. They look at what they can exploit and, of course, they go after those that do not update. So critical updates are the ones mostly that you're looking for because a critical update usually means that it's not that it's necessarily easy, but once you know how to do it, you can actually get into a computer that is connected online. So it's critical in that nature that it's once you know how to hack that flaw, you are capable of doing pretty much anything with a computer. So that is the critical security flaw. It's important to fix it. It doesn't mean somebody knows about it. It doesn't mean necessarily that it is exploited by hackers, but it is important to fix because once somebody knows how to exploit it, it is easy to do so. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.